Hey guys, I don't know about anybody out there, but Kirsty and I love our fidget spinners. They definitely are great for stress relief. So, we're just playing around with it. We have what? How many do we have in the house right now? One, two, three, four, five, six, right? Yeah. We have six of them in the house right now. So, we're going to try a little trick. Kirstie's going to spin two at a time, and then she's going to go up to three, and so on and so forth. So, here we go. Yeah, sorry. Right. Now I got two. All right. Spin them again. Yeah. Here we go. We got the two. Yep. Turn them sideways so they can see that there's two there. Okay, now she's going to add a yellow emoji one, and that is also a glow in the dark. Oh. <laughs> she she did it before. Give her a chance. Don't don't give up on her yet, guys. <laughs> Whoa. Don't give up on her yet. Okay, it's got to go on the outside. <laughs> okay. Whoop. <laughs> the pink one's really heavy. It's like got metal in it. Mm. The light up one spins really good. And so does the pink one. But the yellow one, it's kind of like, oh, it's like I don't want to spin. There, we, there go. we go. Three of them going at once. That looks cool. <laughs> okay, let's see, guys. Do you think she could do four? Oh my gosh, I already tried and I wasn't successful, but... Ah, let's see, can she do four of them? She's adding a blue emoji one. <laughs> Whoop! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can't do four. Okay, four's a fail, guys. <laughs> but but hey, win. three's good. <laughs> we challenge any one of you out there that likes their fidget spinners to try and spin more than three. And do this at a time. Oh, and spin on the very sure. As soon as I point the camera at you, <laughs> hold on, spin hold on. on the very tip, the very tip of your finger. Of Just your like finger. That. You got some mad skills. There you go. <laughs> We've seen Nikki do it on her forehead. <laughs> yep. Nikki has spun it on her forehead. Really? Can you do, do that? Oh, I don't know. Do it on your nose. <laughs> okay, spinning nope. on the nose. Fidget spinning <laughs> nose. Voila! There you go, guys. So once again, we challenge you guys to do your fidget spinner on the tip of your finger, on the tip of your nose, and to do to beat Kirsty's record of spinning. <laughs> On the tip of your so chin, it on the tip of your toe. <laughs> but you have to beat Kirsty's record of spinning three at a time. Catch you later. I got five spinners. <laughs> so the new record to beat now is five spinners <laughs> at one time, guys. Good morning, neighborhood community. Good morning. So we got a very exciting evening coming up tonight. We're going to try and put up a short video before we leave. Um, hopefully that can happen. <sighs> Meanwhile, I'm still in pain from my kidney stone. But uh, we're gonna, I'm going to push through because we've got a very exciting evening with the investigation coming up. Today is Friday the 13th, one of our favorite days, and it's even more special because it is October Friday the 13th. Mm-hmm. Yup. So it's a great night to do a ghost investigation. What do you think, babe? It's like having two Halloweens. Mm-hmm. In October, right? Yep. Boomer. As soon as I sit down, <laughs> so, um, it's going to be an exciting evening. Uh, meanwhile, I'm just going to relax as much as I can before we have to go because of being in so much pain. Um, uh, Kevin's got a job that he's got to go do. What do you got to do? Another fan. Turn the camera around so people can see you. They already saw me. Well, when you're talking about you, you should have the camera on you. What are you doing today? Putting in a fan. Right, Boomy? <laughs> 
And then he's got to come back and make sure all our equipment's got fresh batteries and all of that kind of stuff so that we can um, <coughs> have everything ready for tonight. We're picking Kirstie up on the way because she's going to go with us and, and uh, man a camera and be a part of it tonight. She's very excited about that. I still have to figure out how to pay her back. So, yeah. Hey guys, so we're starting to get everything together to go on our investigation this evening. Um, Kevin's got all the equipment together, the spirit box, the echo box, the K2 meter. Um, what else do we have, baby? You want to look at it all? Yeah, you the got box it all. Is still open. Opened up in here. I don't have the best carrying system yet, but we have... Um, three cameras, including the one you're holding. Uh, speaker for our EVP stuff, uh, including the spirit box um, and the uh, echo box, which is over here. And we have the K2 meter. We also have a... Uh, uh, digital recorder. Yeah. This is not a digital recorder. This no. is the uh, Gauss meter, uh, okay. electromagnetic field. Uh, something for temperature that we don't use very often. We've got um, high-tech audio right now that belongs to Dave. Uh, light for the cameras. Light for the cameras. I also have infrared light and um, all the cameras have infrared light on them. And some just and no, uh, you're not going and, and neither are you. Okay, so we're on our way. Um, we have a couple of stops to make before we actually get to um, Jake and Jordan, Brian and Taylor's house where we're doing the investigation tonight. And I'm feeling a little odd. Um, there could be several reasons why. One, I haven't done an investigation in a long time and a cleansing of a house and, and whatnot. So I could be a little nervous about that, but I'm feeling the way I feel when I feel a spirit with me. And being Friday the 13th and doing this investigation on Friday the 13th, the veil is going to be thinner to begin with. And I feel like we're not only going to be dealing with the spirits that are in the home, we're going to be having visitors um, because the veil is going to be lowered. And talking about that is making me feel anxious. Just thought I'd let you guys know how things are how I'm feeling right now and leading up to what's going to be going on tonight. Hey, what's going so on? So, Kirsty is coming with us to do the investigation. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling right now? Pretty good. Are you, are you nervous? Mad, bro? Scared? No, I'm not nervous or scared or anything at the moment. You mad, bro? You mad, are bro? Are you mad, bro? <laughs> Hey, gamer terminology can never get away from it, Anna. <laughs> <laughs> so, are you looking forward to this? Yes, if anything, I'm looking forward to it. And I'm like, just kind of more or less curious as to what it is that, you know, is going to come out of the situation. I don't know. You know? So, I'm optimistic and it's good. And you're going to be manning a camera? Yes. Uh, Kevin will... I'll be sure trying. I'm not, I'm not the best cameraman, but or woman, so we'll see how that goes. Well, you're going to learn tonight, and uh, Kevin will show you what to do. And, Sounds good. Uh, yeah. Sounds so. very good. <laughs> Wait a minute, Bomber. Bomber. A bulldozer, more like it. There you are. Bomber, look at Kevin. Look at Kevin. There's another one. Come look at Kevin. Another one. Hi. Hi. You're so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're gorgeous. Get over here. You're going to get your picture taken with me.
as soon as the mouth is open. What was for breakfast? Bacon. Huh, Angel, what was for breakfast? Bacon. Let me know. Bacon. <laughs> <laughs> so we had a very interesting evening last night. Uh, it was tiring. Very tiring. Um, Kevin and I both got home and we were exhausted. I slept. Val didn't. Yeah, I, I couldn't sleep again. So, um, be interesting once we go through all the evidence to see what, what we find. Um, I am just going to relax today. I'm having opposite problems with my stomach today than I normally have. Mm. And, um, how strange is that? I am definitely not used to having these problems, and it's very uncomfortable. I'd rather have my, my regular issues, I think. <laughs> so, um, other than that, um, I'm just going to lounge around and do so, some stuff. So this morning... Um, I um, had, I got a, a lead, and I missed it because um, I didn't expect the lead to pop in at, on Saturday morning. So I didn't bring the phone in with me, or I would have if I wasn't so tired, because I had just basically forgot. And um, when I got up, Dave had uh, texted me and told me that we had a lead, and I checked the lead, and it had it happened at 7 in the morning, which would have made me very angry in the first place. But um, on a Saturday morning, we're getting leads. Uh, I kind of remember us saying that we don't want them on Saturdays. No yeah. weekend leads. But uh, they did it anyway, and we didn't get it anyway because I didn't get to, uh, to a call until a couple hours afterwards, and somebody else had already snapped it up, I'm sure. So that was my morning, and um, pretty much just going to be more of the same, cleaning up getting the garage ready for some real good stuff and uh, we have some work um, lined up for next week so we'll be good but today I think Kirstie's coming over later we're gonna watch some movies mm -hmm. are you ready yeah and uh, Kevin's gonna... actually gonna go to the ranch with her tonight and see the horses and um, there's a couple of clips that we filmed a couple of days ago that we didn't get up with fidget has spinners. something to do with fidget spinners. And, and a we'll, challenge. Those will go up in today's... Uh, fidget block. spinners and a challenge for <laughs> all of those <laughs> people out there that are daring and willing to accept the challenge. 